All right, guys, so this is for the RC79, the 8th gen, I believe this is the 8th gen VFR800 Honda Interceptor. So oil filter is kind of a pain to get off on this bike. Um, basically, once we come down here, first of all, you have to remove this lower part of the fairing, um, several fasteners, and then they have these hooks. So once you take all the fasteners out, you kind of slide it back and drop it down, and it comes out that way. But what Honda wants you to do, which I gotta lay down, is right up there is the oil filter. So without removing the lower brace of the radiator, you can't really get the oil filter through the spot. There's just not enough clearance. So what Honda wants you to do is they want you to take the bolt out of the bottom here, go to the front, and you can see there is one, two, three, four fasteners to take out. After that point, you can push the radiator forward and out of the way, and that gives you enough room to wiggle out this filter. You are still going to need a cup wrench in order to remove it and replace it. Um, you can use the universal ones to remove it. Uh, you might be able to get a strap wrench on, but you should use a wrench to replace it because it is next to impossible to get any like arm torque on it. I think it only takes like 16 foot pounds, but still. There is another method. It's more work for the first time, but after that it's a lot easier. So on this side of the bike, there is a charcoal canister and it is mounted right like this. So if you remove the vacuum lines to it, um, this is for emissions, this is a smog thing. So here in the States, we don't really care. At least most of the States don't really care. California cares, the rest of us don't really. If you remove this, you'll have an open hose. Um, you can reroute the hoses to the other part to drain down too, because their job is to really, you know, vent after it goes through the charcoal filter anyways. But now you can see the oil filters right there and you can get a hand in there. You can actually get a good grip on it. You might not need a wrench. And then after that, you can just slide it out this way. So much more room. The previous generation VFR 800 did not have a radiator right here. So they had the radiators on the side on each side, which I actually prefer this design a little bit better. Um, but at the same time, getting an oil filter off on that bike's not too bad. Getting it off on this bike's a little bit harder, a little bit more tricky. So I didn't see a video online for this, so this is just an informational video, I'm not a videographer or anything like that. So this is not high quality. This is iPhone. Well, this isn't even iPhone. This is Google, Google phone video quality so anyways i hope this helps um and uh keep riding thank you